Yeah, welcome to Easy Mathematics and a new video to the MIT Integration B 2021. This integral is from the final round and it's an integral from minus pi over 4 up to pi over 4 of the inverse tangent of e to the tangent of x. And yeah, this is a quite interesting integral because if you think of, of an antiderivative of an inverse tangent, and there is no simple function when you differentiate, you only get the inverse tangent. And of course, if there is an antiderivative and you differentiate, there is some chain rule going on. So it seems like there is... So the way is not to calculate the antiderivative and then plug in the boundaries. There is a another way um, you have to think of and if you want to try this by yourself one hint is split up the integral and think of the fact I'm pretty sure you know this the tangent is an odd function and think of how this can help you here uh, I was thinking of giving another hint but uh, I do not want to do it I want to give this as a hint yeah so pause the video if you want to try it by yourself and then come back okay so like i said um, you cannot expect an antiderivative to this function and we will use of course this here and um, we will see in a couple of minutes why this is so important. So first, let's split up this integral. The left integral, we make a substitution. So x is minus t. Okay, so here, here we make a substitution. x is minus t. And if you do that, we get minus dt. Yeah, so the minus, we switch the boundaries and uh, the signs are changing, so we get from 0 to pi over 4 inverse tangent e to the tangent of minus x and tangent is an odd function so we get 1 over e to the tangent of x, okay? plus yeah, the second integral we leave it as it is inverse tangent e to the tangent of x alright so again if you make a simple substitution x to the minus t we get the minus here the minus we can switch the boundaries from zero and then because of the of the substitution the signs get also changed here okay and e to the minus tangent is 1 over e to the tangent so this is where we use the fact that tangent is odd Okay, and now if you are familiar with some arc, um, so inverse trigonometric functions for positive x, for x positive we have inverse tangent x plus inverse tangent 1 over x equals pi over 2. And this is exactly what we have. Inverse tangent of something plus inverse tangent of the reciprocal. And this is pi over 2. Yeah, so integral is linear, so we put these again together. So we get integral from 0 to pi over 4. The sum of these two arc tangents, this is pi over 2. Pi over 2 dx and if you integrate this this is easy you get pi squared over 8 and this is our final result very nice integral in my opinion and again um, how to come up with this of course this integral there is some yeah, trick and none of these functions are there because 
of fun, so they are there because on purpose. And you can't expect an antiderivative. And so the tangent is an odd function. And there is a nice relation between inverse tangents. And we see here also, we could have solved the integral more general. And I just want to write it down, even for this integral, from minus pi over 4 up to pi over 4, inverse tangent, then some base, to an odd function, is also pi squared over 8, where the base is positive. Okay, you know, so you can think of that arctangent of b to an odd function will give the same result. Thanks for watching, hope you liked it, see you next time, bye bye.